We're speaking here with Abel Tomlinson, and he's telling me that he he's given all the way here to Washington with the Lincoln Memorial behind him from Fayetteville, Arkansas. That's right. He's a friend of our co-host. Let's see him live. But, but boss, what induced you to drive? How many hours was that? We drove 18 hours from Arkansas. How many times did you stop? Uh, we uh, stopped for gas, but we uh, stayed in a hotel overnight on Friday night. Where was that? What's that? Where was that? Uh, near uh, Nashville, Tennessee. Nash. So what induced you to come all the way here? Well, I've been a peace activist since the Iraq war started, and I've uh, been a journalist, and uh, I'm very concerned about the issue of war and peace and the threat of nuclear war. And uh, this is the first major anti-war protest uh, uh, about the, Iraq, uh, the Ukraine war. And I'm pretty happy to see that there's people speaking out and dissenting against uh, this proxy war with Russia that is disastrous and threatens us with nuclear war. And uh, to me, that's the most important issue in the world. Uh, it would instantly render all the other issues irrelevant if we uh, enter a nuclear winter. So you wouldn't miss it for anything then? No, no. And I plan, I'm hoping this inspires me to go back to Arkansas and uh, do some more local anti-war work there. We, we have protests, we've had protests since the Iraq war started about all the wars and threats of wars. And uh, so far we've only had one, uh, I organized one protest against the U Ukraine proxy war uh, at the beginning of uh, this recent escalation last February, but we haven't had many since. There's been actually a big division within the local peace community. Half of our peace community in Fayetteville is supporting the war. They've been tricked into thinking that you know that they're against the war but they end up supporting the war it's really a it's really an unfortunate situation we've had a big division among our activists locally and you're going back tonight you said uh we're going to drive back uh this evening and drive part of the way and again stay and then finish our trip we'll be back tomorrow same motel in nashville uh, i don't know about nashville but somewhere along the way <laughs> okay very good able very nice to talk to you thank you thanks bye-bye bye, -bye. bye.